one of those things where, you know, you can manage stress through some tools, but keep in mind, stress will always manifest physically. Hey everyone, it's Dr. Jonathan at Counseling Chiropractic, your Baltimore area chiropractor. And this is Kaylee. Hello. What are we doing today? We are going to be doing a Q&A on everyday back pain. Nice. I love that. <laughs> All right. Shoot. Get it going off the bat. Uh-huh. Why would someone experience back pain in their daily life? Ooh, that's a loaded question because there's a lot of different reasons why people can potentially feel back pain. I think a lot of times nowadays people are sitting too long uh, with that sedentary lifestyle. I know you have to work, computer work, desk work. That can kind of contribute to a lot of tissues being a little dysfunction and static in one position, which can cause some back pain, potentially. Are there like specific exercises that someone can do at home if they're having back pain? 100%. So there's a lot of core stability exercises that most of the generic population can do. And if you haven't seen our other videos out there with core stability, check them out and we will love to show you some of those exercises either in a video or if you come to our clinic too. So yes, there so are. Yes. Simple answer, yes. Mm -hmm. So you talked about exercises that you can do. Let's say these exercises aren't working and they come in to get an adjustment. What do you think these people are gonna go through when they come in for an adjustment? What should someone expect if they walk in here for an adjustment? As like a new patient with yeah. like never being adjusted before. Yeah. Cool, so even if you have been adjusted coming into our office, you're gonna have the experience of um, meeting the doc, meeting the staff, getting evaluated with the examinations with the doctor and the staff, and then coming up with a treatment plan uh, that fits your um, needs while you're coming in. The big thing is getting you out of pain. The adjustments help with restoring motion back to some areas that aren't moving as well. We're not putting bones back in place. We're not realigning anything. So um, in addition to educating patients about the adjustments, the adjustments themselves should help uh, reduce their pain. Now let's say exercises, they come and do them, they get an adjustment. What can they do in their daily life to kind of help reduce like the stress, reduce anything that can kind of contribute to the back pain? Sure, so stress is one of those things where, you know, you can manage stress through some tools, but keep in mind stress will always manifest physically. So um, if you are a very stressful person or easily stressed out, Cold exposure is really good for people to do to have that stimulus into their body that's very stressful. So if they kind of get that exposure from like a very frequent time period in a week or even months, that can help trigger some good chemicals like endorphins and dopamine to help with stressful events. In addition to that, what was your second point, part of that question? How can they I guess reduce it. Like how are there like effective stress mm, techniques mm. that can reduce Techniques it? like other than the exercises like we mentioned. Um, work desk ergonomics is a really big one too. People who sit down for too long, making sure uh, like your computer strings, eye level, your desk, keyboards, 90 degrees with your elbows. Um, so we can teach you all of that in house. And um, yeah, there's a lot of fun things that we can do if people come to our office to one, get out of pain, educate, and then also get into a more of a functional um, plan too, because as a chiropractor, we're always going to acknowledge patients' pain, but we're big advocators as far as really pinpointing and making sure people are functional. So that's where uh, the adjustments and some other things come in too. I think that's all the questions I got. That's it? Awesome. Well. Thanks for watching guys. If you have any questions or comments, write them down below. If you like us, like, subscribe, and we will see you guys next time.